Look at this, what's going on here? Here's the hammer tails. These are genuine Steinway hammers, not Steinway shanks and flanges, and not Steinway repetitions. I didn't do this piano. I was asked to work on this piano after it had some touch-up work done. We redid the dampers because they weren't working at all, and then we're just regulating and voicing the piano. But as I was going through it, I noticed some oddities, kind of some of the issues you can have when someone, quote-unquote, rebuilds your Steinway. This is a Model B. It's actually a really nice sound. Really like this sound, but what is, what is this notching here? Tails, well, you'll notice these parts have these springs called Whippin Assist Springs. They're to help a piano that used to feel really heavy. They're to kind of help it to not feel so heavy. Some of the older Steinways had an issue with being just too heavy for a lot of people. And so, so I can, I can, while I can understand the desire to put these in, they do have some problems. They carved out the tails here because, look, listen to this. You hear that clicking? despite their efforts, they're still hitting the springs. So just some of the issues you can have when you get a rebuilt Steinway and you mix aftermarket parts, but that's not the only thing. My other gripe is this. Those are not straight up and down. They should not be able to stay up like that. There's too much friction on these flanges, you know, and do I want to go through and repin all of them? I'll be honest, I don't. Okay, and friction is, that is a big deal. Make no mistake about it. So, just so you're aware, this is some of the thing that can happen. Some people will say, well, Renner's owned by Steinway and Renner parts have been put in Hamburg Steinways for years and years and years. Well, there are Renner parts that are meant for the Hamburg Steinways. These are not them. And yes, Steinway does own Renner and, and they're using a lot of parts now from Renner, but they're, they're different. And, and I, I never run into, I have never yet run into this, these pinning issues. Again, I understand why they went this direction, but there can be problems. I've had people so frustrated with these clicks. They just say, just change it back. Just take it all off and put the genuine parts on. So there's my two cents. I haven't filmed in a while, so I thought I'd pop in here with something I was working on. See you later.